JC Game Studios. What's up everyone, I'm the Devastating Just Cause and this is DJC Game Studios. Welcome, it's another TurboGrafx-16 North American Hue card release and it is number three on our list and that is Alien Crush. How do you crush an alien? With a trash compactor? A car? An anvil? Something really heavy, I'm guessing. A hammer? Catch it the coat and whack it with a hammer. I'm kidding, of course. This is uh, one of the three pinball releases. I believe it was three. There might be more. But I remember there's Time Cruise, Devil's Crush, and Alien Crush that were the top three that I know of. So here it is, Hue Card release number three on our list. TurboGrafx-16, Alien Here it is, video pinball at its finest in, in the late 80s. This is Alien Crush, Hudson Soft. Let's get going. We'll start with slow speed. first little I want to call it like a mini game but it's more of a mini boss nice no that's not what I wanted to do pretty ni pretty nifty though for the time you know Really cool graphics. Creepy, too. And there's more in this series. <laughs> aliens creeping around. Spit it out. Ha ha ha. it. Ooh. Hey, that's okay. That was, I don't think I've ever had it go down there before and back up like that. Another spit out here. There's other ones in here uh, that, that are, uh, I think that's, t I believe it's Time Cruise and Devil's Crush are the other two in the pinball series. With Alien being one of my favorites. Um, once again, I'm more of a real pinball than a, than a virtual, but yeah, remember this is 1989 and all these little, they really made this fun and it, and it was impressive, you know? The rest of those little eyeballs hit. There's. Come on. That's going back in. It's going to shoot out. I just need to get that one. Oh, shoot. Damn it! 
almost. <laughs> A little better this time, though. side whoops a little too far there so we're gonna get the other three on this side oh nice so we just get that last red one Oop. goes back into the points. Here we are again. No! Man, that, every time I get the, the friggin' centipede or the whatever that thing is, the snake. Oh! oh. We're still doing very well. We're not losing balls. I was going to say we're not losing balls yet, but I was trying not to tilt it, but... Technology. Oh man, that was. Let's get those out. Let's. We gotta blast into those eyes. Okay, here we go. Let's not lose it this time. And I lost it again. I'm trying. Am I? In the brain! Had to shake it. So you can shake it because it took your mother nine months to make it. Is that, I think that's what all the kids are saying these days. Nice. This is unbelievable though. up and he's looking scarier and scarier every time I see him. Ouch. Oh, I did not do the match. Game over at 12,550,000. I'm sorry, excuse me, 1,255,200. Woo! I'll take it. Alien Crush Turbo Graphics 60. Well, there it is, Alien Crush on the Turbo Graphics 16. Uh, this is one that's pretty popular among the people that like this virtual pinball type game, especially the early 80s. 
Uh, I, sh I should say the late 80s going into the 90s. Um, once we uh, play these other ones, you'll see how it kind of progresses. Um, but this one still holds up really good. It's fun to play. It's it's creepy. It's got those, you saw as that alien kind of wakes up, the more aliens you hit off the side. You get those little mini boss or puzzle battles on other boards when the, when one of the things eats it. It's 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 pretty cool. Um, for virtual video game pinball, 1989, I'd say that's one of my tops. Anyways, please like, please subscribe, and we'll see ya in the next one. Take care, everyone. DJC Game Studio.